When you think about the job market and the importance of having a specific skill, this is one of the biggest ones. Um, HVAC because you're always going to need to either heat or cool something at some particular point in time, whether it be a house, a business, a home, whatever the case may be, it's going to definitely need HVAC. Hi, I'm George Coleman and I'm a recent graduate of Tidewater Tech HVAC program and I'm a retired military member from the United States Navy. Wanted to do something different that would uh, challenge me. It was something outside of my normal comfort zone to where I actually did stuff with my hands. I was learning things that I had never seen, never touched them or worked with them before. It seems to come pretty naturally once you actually see it, touch it, know what it is. It's very hands-on. So if you have a skill or, or a trade that's going to be essential, you know on a day-to-day -day basis you're needed in the community. We take care of uh, the refrigeration, we take care of um, their HVAC problems, anything like that that deals with refrigerating meat, refrigerating um, groceries, refrigerating frozen goods, anything that might deal with air conditioning throughout that whole building. We never stopped doing what we had to do because we were considered essential workers. To where we still had to go out and you know, do those trouble calls and everything, take care of those businesses, so they could you know, run in a normal capacity um, and be able to still serve the people as, as we serve them. Going through the program, it's, it's gonna give you every essential thing that you're gonna need out there to feel and you're gonna to touch it, feel it, know what it is, be able to describe it, be able to recognize it. We did wiring, we did uh, pump downs, we put this freezer together. There was different things that we learned that we knew we'd be using out in the field that became essential because we had experience with it here at the school. So it was, it was definitely enlightening once you know something and you're able to recognize it as soon as you get out into the field. If you want to do something that's going to be hands-on, that's not going to take four years of your life to where you're going to have to repay it back in the next 20, 30 years, and know that it's going to be essential and it's going to be beneficial for your future, why not give it a chance? <laughs>